What you're doing by being here today is you are standing up and you are saying that you want to change your story, that you want to be in control of your story. The amount of courage it took for me to step away from what logically on paper is like the American dream. For the first time in my life, I felt like I was living my purpose. Because what I get to do with Yoke and Abundance is I work with women every single day, helping them identify what it is that they most want to be doing and helping them build their roadmap to go after what they want. I had studied business tactics. I had my big girl business plan. Like, I thought I had an awesome roadmap. Our failures are our greatest learning opportunities. And so I had all of that set up and I was ready to go. For the first time in my life, I was moving towards something instead of feeling like I was pushing away from something. Alicia is an amazing public speaker. I've seen her speak publicly multiple times and I knew when I was putting together my speaker list, uh, I have to get Alicia on the list. So I'm so glad that she came and spoke to our event. She was one of the most highly rated speaking sessions. She's an amazing person. She knows a ton about business growth failure and she's just so dynamic speaking that if you're thinking about having her speak at your event or even on your podcast, you should get her on the podcast, get her on your show ASAP because she's only going to add value to you and your audience and your listeners. So if you are looking for a speaker, someone who's dynamic and personable and down to earth, who can help people think through this whole process of business failure, opportunity, and growth, and resiliency, and not quitting, get Alicia to your show. All right, talk soon. Bye. I want to leave you with this thought. Robert Ingersoll said, we rise by lifting others. So I hope you all will reach out and lift each other up. And thank you so much for being here today. I really appreciate all of you. Thank you.